Here we are in Sigma Plot version 13 for Windows, and we want to do a simple one-way ANOVA between three sets of data. We've got three sets of data on the screen. We've got the control data, drug 1 data, and drug 2 data. You can see that these data sets are of uneven size. This doesn't matter. A one-way ANOVA does not require data sets to be of equal size. We have created a simple bar graph of these three data sets, where we can see control, drug 1 and drug 2 treatment groups on the single graph. We wish to do a comparison between control and drug 1 and drug 2 and see whether any of them are statistically different from each other according to the normal distributed data we have on the screen. So the way to do a one-way ANOVA is to select the three data sets you wish to compare, go to the analysis window and from the drop-down box choose one-way ANOVA and then we can click on the Run button. The screen will come up and ask you what format your data are in, and these are raw data, so we click on Next. Because we have highlighted these three columns before we entered the Statistical Analysis Options window, you can see that it's automatically selected these three. This saves a lot of time clicking. Now you click on Finish. The software has calculated that the treatments are significantly different and has recommended we do a post hoc test. From the drop down list you can choose the post hoc test you wish to apply and I'm going to choose Bonferroni in this case. Then you can choose what kind of comparison you want. You can do an all pairwise comparison or just a comparison of your data versus control. On this example we're going to choose versus control and click on the next. It's then going to ask us what our control group is. Well, we've already labeled it control, so let's list control here and press finish. The one-way ANOVA report comes up on the screen in front of us and we can scroll down and show the multiple comparison data at the bottom. Since we only chose to be versus control, it hasn't compared drug one to drug two, for instance. But you can see here that control versus drug two is significantly different but control versus drug 1 is not significantly different. If we remind ourselves of what the data looked like, we would agree with that summary, that perhaps control and drug 1 are not different from each other, but control and drug 2 are different from each other. So that's a very simple way to perform a one-way ANOVA in Sigma plot.